Hi, I'm Ashley, the Monogram Mompreneur, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to sublimate a pillowcase. Um, this is perfect for a gift, um, whether you're a grandmother and you're having the grandkids over for a slumber party, or maybe you're having um, a slumber party birthday party and you want to make gifts um, for all the, your child's friends. Um, this is the perfect thing. Um, so here I am placing um, the PNG alphabet I bought um, and I'm just placing it in PicMonkey. I use PicMonkey to design all my sublimation designs and I'm just placing the letters where I want them and then I'm adding, um, I have the PicMonkey where you can import your own fonts. So I'm just picking a font that I like to go with the PNG alphabet and then the design will be ready to go. what you can do on PicMucky. I just imported um, the alpha pack that I bought um, from Sprinkled, Sprinkled Ink and then I used one of my fonts I have in PicMucky and so I created this awesome thing that I'm going to make a pillowcase out of. Um, I even used the teardrop or the dropper tool to match the colors which is really awesome. So um, let's get it printed out on our sublimation printer and let's get it pressed. I always forget to put my tray out, but there is the sublimation design. Um, I always mirror it, and then so I'm placing the pillowcase on the heat press, making sure I find the perfect spot, and I'm lint rolling it to make sure there's no lint. And then I place um, the design on just to make sure it fit. I'm going to do a little pre-press with my butcher paper for about 10 to 15 seconds um, just to make sure I get all the moisture out. And we're done with that. And now I'm just going to trim up my design a little bit. Um, I like to trim off some of the excess white just to make sure I can center it properly. All right, now that my design is all trimmed, I'm gonna place it onto my pillowcase. I have the heat press set at about 400 degrees, and I'm gonna put my butcher paper back over to prevent any type of gas from getting on my um, heat press, and it's gonna go for one minute. All right. Let's see how it looks. It took no time at all to do that. So that's it for today. Please make sure you hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Bye for now.